before we can begin balancing equations, it's important that we establish some equation terminology. So this here is a chemical equation or a reaction. The items to the left of this arrow are called reactants, and the items that appear to the right of this arrow are called products. So reactants are on the left, and products are on the right. Additionally, um, these small numbers that appear after element symbols, those are called subscripts. And we'll contrast that with coefficients. Coefficients appear before the symbol or formula. Here you can see there is no coefficient, so in this case, um, a coefficient of 1 is implied. So the coefficients here would be 1, 3, and 2. The number and type of each atom on the left must equal the number and type on the right. This is called the law of conservation of mass. So whatever we have on the left, that has to be equal to what's on the right. And once again, that's called the law of conservation of mass. We'll discuss that more in class and maybe do a few demonstrations with that. Um, but that's the law of conservation in words. So for example, we have six hydrogen on the left. Here they are. And we have six hydrogen on the right. Here they are. So here's how I got that number six. Hydrogen is diatomic. There's two of them per molecule. And we have three hydrogen molecules. So we do three times two is six. Here, two times three is six. We also have to make sure that nitrogen is balanced. We have two nitrogens on the left and two nitrogens on the right. So let's see. Here's our two nitrogens on the left. And here are our two nitrogens on the right. So this coefficient here of two, that applies to both the nitrogen and the hydrogen.